I'm Eddie Grindersleeve. I'm 32 and I'm from Lexington, Texas. I feel like I'm very driven. This is my sixth year in, in the ACL. You know, I practice pretty much daily. I feel like if you really want it, you'll, you'll figure out a way to make it happen. I have grown. I feel like every year I've gotten a little bit better, have improved a little bit. And it's just because I push myself at home to get to this point. I put a lot of time into it early on, every weekend, you know, hours a day. And I've learned to get away from that now that I have a family and balanced time. I give everything, I give it my all. Early on playing cornhole, I, I used to uh, train horses, so I was doing a lot of horse stuff. It's called colt starting, so I'll take uh, horses that have never been ridden and I'll do 30 to 60 days on them. And I would basically get them to where you can start riding them and putting time on them. My goal was just to make them comfortable and I would desensitize them and get them used to different objects, different things moving around. It was challenging in its ways, but it also brought a lot of enjoyment when I was able to, to see the change and see progress. I started that when I was in high school. It was kind of just my side, my side job after school, messing with horses. And that's gonna end it. Brindersleeve and Batson win the national here in Portland. I wasn't even Caleb and I ended up going three in a row, two nationals back to back, and then finishing up with the world championship. I felt like the first one was very, very special and it was also a feel of, it was a sigh of relief. It's like something that everybody's trying to reach for and we finally got to that point. And so after the second one, I told myself the second one felt better than the first one because people were also gunning for us at that point. You know, they were wanting us to, you know, wanting to really beat us. And so to finish it off with Worlds was just special. We were able to accomplish, you know, arguably one of the best double seasons in the ACL history. Caleb and I joke around that we're the reason these teams, you know, ended up switching and changing. I still feel like we have more to prove. I feel like we still fly under the radar for some reason, and I, th I think we have more, more noise to make. Our goal is to be the best doubles team of all time.